So first off the bat, welcome to the Geek Tech Show and over here I do product testing. Well, you don't have to test anything because I do it just for you. So I have had the iPhone 2020 ever since it came out. It is Apple's so-called budget phone. It's much cheaper than that $1,000 phone. At around 400 bucks plus taxes, which actually goes almost to $500 depending on the options, you're getting a very decent phone. So if you don't need the best specs, the best of everything, you get the budget edition of this phone. So the question is, what do I like and what do I hate about this phone and why am I getting the brand new one? So first off, the brand new one has one feature or actually it has a lot of different features in here but the ones that I really care about are specific ones. So the best features out of this thing is one is its speed. It is phenomenal. Compared to the other phones, when you press on the browser, when you press on anything else here, it's amazing. It just opens it up right away, like super fast. Everything is just extremely fast that you usually don't ever get. So that is just awesome in my opinion. Small phone, it is something that some people like and dislike. So what is not to like about a small phone? A lot of people are complaining that this phone is too small. In my opinion, versus the original iPhone, this is exactly the right size. I want my phone to be small. If I need to see bigger stuff, I just bring it closer to my eyes. It is really that simple. Some people think the bigger the better. Think about it this way. If it is big, you just put it away from you and you use it. What's the point? You can just move it closer and it will get bigger. It is really you're paying extra money all for nothing. Also some people are complaining about those black things right here on the top of the bottom. I like it. It reminds me of the classic phone. It is a plus in my opinion. Now, what I dislike about this phone is a different story. We'll get into this soon. But another thing I like about this, it has the 2022, has the best specs. We get the best camera. We get the best video quality all in one small and cheap package. So called Apple cheap. This is the cheapest Apple phone. And that is great news because the previous one, that's one thing this thing sucked at is the camera and the video, especially in low light. And this actually solves it. And that's great. In fact, I might not even need a GoPro anymore because it does almost everything. Not only that, its grass is much stronger as well. So you can bang this against a brick and it's not going to break as easy as before. Another plus to it, it is IP67 six, six, or 670, I don't know, whatever it is, 67. It makes it waterproof. And yes, I threw this thing accidentally into the water and it still was working. So yeah, the waterproof thing is awesome. In my opinion, that's a plus too. And this one just gets you the same exact deal. How awesome is that? So people are complaining about this phone. Some things they're like, well, why didn't they change this and that? Guess what? It's good. And I like it. The button. One of the reasons I like this phone is that this is the best iPhone out there. Don't let anyone else tell you it's not. It is. Why? Because it has the button. Everything else just sucks. It doesn't have the button. I hate stuff without a button. I'm one of those guys who like to press on things. And this got this button that I like. I like to click on stuff. I chick, 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 chick. I like it. And if you remove the bottom, I'm going to move to another company that has one. That's right, Apple. Remember what I said. There's millions of people exactly like me who are in the same opinion as well. So the bottom for me is a plus. And other phones don't have it. So this is the only model you can get with a button and it is the cheapest. Win-win in my opinion. Now, next thing about this 
and some people are complaining about this I don't know why you're complaining they're saying well this doesn't give you the best uh, screen the best screen that is available I understand that you want to get the best of everything but you know what in my opinion this is the best screen that they have that Apple makes you know why because the 12 13 and whatever those new screens out there they make me dizzy I can still 10 hours into this phone and not get dizzy on the other hand I would spend like 20 minutes on the 12 or the 13 and it gets me super dizzy I might be one of those few people who gets dizzy from that maybe you're getting dizzy from the phone you don't know if it is the phone you think it's other health issues you think it, it's the 5G it's not the 5G it's the OEL uh, screen and this has the retina which is not as bad but it doesn't get me really dizzy I mean it could get you dizzy but this is best that's right and you can turn off the 5G that's one thing I dislike about the new phone it has the 5G in it that's one thing I like about this one it doesn't have 5G but most networks still cannot do 5G not only that you can just turn the boot off, off if you want to protect yourself from less radiation and another thing you can do just turn off the 5G in the network and it still will work just fine and it's not going to give you the 5G radiation one more thing about this and people are still complaining Some, there's always somebody complaining about something and I seen this in the video they're like well I don't like this phone because of its shape why did they keep the same shape it looks identical to the previous model and you'll be like well if the previous model looks exactly like it why should you upgrade because both of them look the same guess what that's a plus in my opinion because I don't have to spend any extra money getting another case and paying for it I already have an existing one that I like and I can just flip it over there that's a plus in my book now if you want to complain about anything in the new product complain about this the old one look at the red this one just sucks look at this it's not even red look at this this is bloody red yeah it's actually red so if anything they figured out and put a better color code on the red version in fact if you're gonna get the black version don't even bother the red one is just so much better than the black one the only thing I will complain about what I dislike about this phone is that it doesn't have any more color codes to this what is the gold version what is the green version what is the purple version oh the pink for the pink levels this is missing those versions why haven't they made those different versions in this why don't they have a stealth black version why don't they have a camouflage version that's my favorite version I have to get maybe a camel or a a green one if I really needed green and now it has a terminator eye to it when you put in here see red terminator eye get it but overall this is a great phone in fact I dropped this multiple times with a UAG case it didn't break so I don't know what people are complaining about this is breakable more easily and they made it even more unbreakable in this version so in my opinion this is the best iPhone that you can actually get as of this moment it gives you the best photography gives you the best videos and why did I get this just for that forget everything else forget everything else about this phone that's what all I needed for make phone calls smartphone function the button nice camera nice video and check out my other video where I go ahead and do head-to-head -head test with this function so should you get this for yourself answer it and I would say yes get this this phone is gonna blow your mind it will make you rethink what Apple phone is all about now 
in case you did enjoy this make sure to smash a thumbs up button subscribe to this channel and see you in the next video where we do honest real reviews where nobody sponsors those videos and for this i give a thumbs up and it is your job right now to help me out smash the thumbs up button if you got all the way here and leave a comment below if you have any questions Thank you.